That's all the come at vengeance. But tonight we get this. But it is a non-title match. But this will be a preview of vengeance. And that guy right there is very, if not extremely, confident. And why wouldn't he be? He's been pretty much taunting Astro quite a lot and assaulting him too and succeeding at it. So many assaults, so many hindrances and attacks. And uh, Sonic is ready to go probably here tonight. He's more than happy to compete with Astro and weaken the champion before vengeance. As long as it didn't take something out of him. Which it probably will. But we'll have to see if Sonic is willing and able enough. Can you dig it, sucker? Moments before vengeance. And no doubt Astros will certainly want vengeance. Happily named from Sonic's attacks and everything else that he's been doing. The assault's been... It's been astronomical on the champion. He gets a little bit of taste of revenge for the night. Astro would probably like nothing more than to prove himself to Sonic to shut up his yap. Sonic has been probably the most mouthy here on Smack uh, Smashdown. Well, wouldn't you be awfully cocky if you were in the title match? If you were in the main event spot? That's where Astroth has been since day one. And now Sonic has eventually climbed the ladder and now he's there as well. This is the perfect opportunity for Sonic and he's not going to make any exceptions. Well, he'll be making exceptions tonight because here we go. With our main event here on Smashdown and ironically this will be the main event have vengeance but it will that will be for the championship so is Sonic and Astroth motivated enough in this non-title match they would have to be they want to go into vengeance as the stronger person and Sonic has the speed as you saw there and the agility and Astroth has the brute strength and power it's a classic power versus speed scenario. Sonic certainly doesn't have the strength that Astroth possesses, but he's certainly way more maneuverable and faster than the monster and the current YouTube champion. But who will come out on top? David or Goliath? Well, David came out on top on that one. Will he come out on top in this situation? And so far, it's not looking that way as Astroth is beating Sonic to the punch here and the power game is coming into play. And Sonic can't seem to be able to control it. Oh, look at this though. Super awesome clothesline there. And Sonic, whoa, going for that spin attack. Sonic once again rebounds off the ropes and another huge clothesline. And this again, going for it a second time and misses. Astroth dodged out of the way of that one. Look at that punch. That knocked Astroth down. Ow. And that's gonna take anyone down that move. You have to be quick on your feet when you're facing Sonic and Astroth, that is not one of his traits. Look out though. Oh, he was quick enough there to capture Sonic who was uh, caught on the top rope there as a cover Two. attempt. Oh. Sonic got out of the counter too. That big fall, plus the strength of Astroth, had to take something out of him there. Every move that Astroth does, it damages you. Astroth trying to be Mr. Maneuverable. That's not what he wants to do. He doesn't want to be Sonic. He wants to be Astroth and bring his power game. As long as he's got Sonic in his clutches, he's got this match in the palm of his hands. Oh, beautiful DDT by the monster there. And maybe Astroff looking to finish this already. That wouldn't surprise me. Astroff has 
Astroff's matches have been very quick as of late, and that's worrying. The better Astroff gets, the longer he's going to be YouTube champion. And the action goes to the outside here. Look at Sonic. Oh, trying to get Astroff as he comes back into the ring now. Didn't work. Astroff resists. Oh, another booming clothesline right in the face. Sonic can use that speed to back up his power and his strength and his punching ability. That's not going to help things. Every move Astroff does is just it just stops you straight away. And Astroff dragging Sonic around, but he resists and into the corner we go. Astroff putting a beat down on Sonic here, the challenger and number one contender for his YouTube title at Vengeance. Oh look at this going for the rug bottom. Didn't get it though. Astroff very aware of Sonic's maneuver. He's uh, been victim to it on a few occasions. Oh, and a Sonic countering the Astroth bomb there. And now Son this is time for Sonic to capitalize on that downfall. Because Astroth don't make a lot of mistakes. Oh. Another counter of the Astroth bomb and Sonic needs to be careful where he treads here. It's crunch time for these two. Oh look at this now. We've seen this maneuver before on Astroth. It is the Super Sonic Elbow Drop. Here we go. This is what blasted Astroth last week I believe. And will it do it this time? Here's a cover. One. Oh no, only a one count. Maybe it didn't knock him out as much this time. Now Sonic's wondering, what do I do? Two. He's attempted to go for the rug bottom and he just pulled off the Three. supersonic elbow on Astroth. And yet the champion is still looking dominant as ever. Sonic trying to catch Astroth on the side there, but he got suplexed back into the ring. And Astroth, another cover here. Two. One, two, and no. Not quite yet. And Sonic again. He's uh, taking his time once more, and Astroth standing tall and dominant here. Two. As always. Three. There's no love that can take down Astroth. Four. Sonic playing some more mind games Five. on the monster while he's being counted out here. I don't think six. this is Sonic's plan to be counted out, but the referee is up to six Seven. right now. He's getting Astroth Eight. impatient. The less, the more impatient Astroth becomes, perhaps the less, the more unable he is to focus on a match. Look at this. Oh, and I call that unfocusedness. Sonic dived back into the ring, but the wrong way, and fell right into the grip of Astroth. And this doesn't look good for the challenger. Counted that attack. Oh. And the referee gets a clothesline and now he's out of it. And that's bad for both these guys because now anything goes when the referee's out. Look out, Sonic. Oh, look at this. Oh, I thought it was going to land on the referee. Lucky for him he did not. It would have been crushed. There's the rock bottom though. Will uh, Sonic get this victory? Yes, he will. My God. He's just pinned Astroth. I saw it. That's a shocker. That's more than a shocker, that's an upset. The YouTube champion has been pinned, and now Sonic has all the motivation to be all that more cocky. The arrogance level is going to increase. Well, Sonic has beaten Astrov here in a non-title match. If we see this at Vengeance, we've got a new champion. Well, if Sonic hasn't been playing mind games in Astro's head now, he certainly has gone into his head now. I'm afraid that's going to do it for Smashdown, though. What an upset, though, for this main event. Sonic has all the bragging rights now going into Vengeance. We've also got the Extreme Rules Women's Title Match. Void vs. Manic, Tails and his mystery tag partner take on the tag champion. Don't forget your match, stupid. Of course, but well, that's all at Vengeance. We'll see you then. My God.